what's up guys it's your boy the logical dude so just back in another day of van life with me you know i guess this is gonna be a little bit of a thing um i really want to just get to where i'm making content all the time so i'm about to just start turning on the camera and just seeing what's up you know and posting it out there on the world like on the youtubes but mainly i'm gonna be focusing on three speed because i believe in the freedom of speech and i believe in that and like, no censorship or nothing like that because, you know, freedom of speech should be a, just a basic human right. And shouldn't be dictated about what a private company wants to do. So, if you guys wondering what I'm doing, I'm getting some of this really beautiful Gorilla Glue number four uh, sugar sauce. I'm going to get me a big old chunk because I'm going to load up my pen here. All right. Yeah, this is the Yukon uh, Evolve Plus XL. Yeah, that's what this thing is. Um, it's got a little thing in the bottom. Uh, I could, you know, put some in it for later. But, yeah, I just licked all that off. This is what I'm going to take on the road. This is the Dabaratus. And this has got... Um, I forgot what the strain of it is that's in here because I've rubbed it off of the sticker. But yeah, it's got this little needle thing and this little spring-loaded little cap that you just push and hold. And a little drop of wax comes out and you can just, I can put it right here on my coils. It's meant to work with a dabber so that you can just press and hold and then just dab it. Um, so yeah, this is what I take on the road with me. So, because part of my nomadic income is uh i drive for several of the delivery services so just name one there's you know three that i'm i'm mainly with one that i mainly do full time all the time it's uh g and an h so yeah i deliver food through the day and uh then i also do content creation you know wordpress stuff but it's a great filler income um it was what got me out of working for Apple. So it was that thing that I needed to give me the push to jump out of that and jump into my own life um, and jump out of that corporate existence. So anyway, um, so what I'm doing right now is I'm getting ready to go out on a shift and uh, I've got a car. So we're going to check that out in just a minute. Uh, I've got two separate vehicles. So I've got the van that I live in. So this is my house. And for the first time in, you know, like four and a half, almost five years since I've been working from home, I finally have some homework separation. It's pretty nice. I like it. Uh, so what I do is I got a storage place uh, where I keep a lot of my stuff. I've got a video booth that I'm building in there, doing some, uh, going to be doing some microgreens growing eventually once I get the power situation all figured out there. Um, but yeah. I've got a parking space at the same storage unit. So that's where I keep the car and lock it up. And so what I do is I come and I drop the van off, pick up the car, go and do my job, come back, drop off the car, pick up the van, go to a park or go somewhere and go and hang out, sleep, watch TV, work, you know, on the computer, do whatever it is I'm going to do. You know, so this is home. That's the, the Grubhub and DoorDash and Postmates work and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, that's pretty much how I'm living right now with my income. I would like to be able to get the driving down to a minimum, uh, mainly just like dinner shifts and mainly just spend my entire day doing nothing but content creation and uh, marketing and that kind of thing, helping, you know, you guys build your businesses up. That's what I really want to do. So, cheers to you. You guys dab it up for the day. Because you all know I'm a heavy cannabis activist. I love it. I live here in Oregon where everything's legal. Now, granted, I probably shouldn't be smoking and driving. Whatever. I don't care, dude. If I didn't fucking smoke and do my job, somebody would hear about it. <laughs> so, uh, that's me for the day, guys. You guys have a good one. Be cool. Be real. And abide. Peace. I forgot to add this into the main clip. Everybody got to do a dad with me. All right. Y'all have a great day. And uh, I'm going to take y'all outside and just kind of give you a brief little look at the car. That's how we're going to end it.
Peace out. Yep, here's the car out here. Just pulled it out. This is where I parked the van. Yep. And that's what I drive and go and deliver food in. It's a little dirty because I had to go through some muddy stuff yesterday. And she needs a bath. I think I got hit by a bird turd on the other side. So, uh, yeah, it's going to happen probably tomorrow. I'm going to give her a bath. So I need to give the van a bath, too. And I want to do a van tour for you guys. But, uh, yeah, the van's been kind of dirty lately. So we've been getting into fall and got a bunch of stuff I'm tracking in. So I want to give it a good vacuum down. But anyway, <clears throat> that's it. Let's see. Chip rides in the back. There he is. He's waiting on me. That's his butt. Let's see. Dude, you ready to go? You ready to go? We're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go make that money. Let's go make that money, Dad. Come on, Dad. We gotta go make that money. Alright, guys. That's it for us. Peace.